Okay. We done took that, uh, we probably got the tire off or whatnot. See those right there got pins. You got to slide them out once you remove the little, little pin on the end. Ain't that do the same for this one. Here's some large brake pads. Like I said, that's a 2019 Genesis G90. Tuck the tire with my impact, which made it quicker. Earthquake XT, get that from Harbor Freight. I need to put some jack stands up on there, however, though. Tire right there. So, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and take these, pull these pins out. We're gonna take this out. And then we're gonna take uh, this one right here out. And then these pins right here, I made the slide out. I ain't got nobody helping me, so I'm trying to hold the camera in, do everything. But I'm gonna show you as we go. I just removed the, the clips to hold the bottom of the back of these pins. These pins, like I said, slide out. So that dust will not start coming out. Once you remove that, that clip, and that little hole right now, pull them clips out, and them pins will just slide on that. Slide on out of there. There's two of them, and one more at the bottom that I gotta take out. All right, I done pull the pins out of there. As you can see, pull the pins out. So now what you might do now, you gonna remove that bolt. So see, you have to get to these bolts down here. Got that access to them. The ones on down here. I show them once they get on down here. Right now, I'm just being lazy. But just remove that one. Okay, I went on and took out that 10 millimeter bolt right there. 10 millimeter. Just bring it on that. And uh, just take that line. Just put it down. It's the first video on 2019 Genesis G90. It ain't none of our brake pads. I've been looking for them. So now what I wanna do, I'm gonna remove this top bolt right here. And then you got a lower bolt right here. And after that, all this shit come off. You gotta give me access to them brakes. The, you know, the other, the Genesis G80, they're made different. They got like a cage right here. You remove that plate, they can just slide the brakes out. But this one made it totally different. It's the big boy though. Okay. And let you see, I didn't, I didn't tuck the brake, brake loose. I got everything on loose now. The sun, uh, working on, I didn't open. See these brake pads in there? And I just tucked the whole thing off. See that bolt right there? And that bolt right, right here. It one right there, one, one up there. Them 17 millimeter bolts. And they, uh, they just go right here. Go right there and one go further down. One go right there and another go right there. And take them loose and you should take everything you got. And see these brakes, they just, uh, Come loose like that. So if I want to take a nerd knot, put one in. Let's see, piston don't, don't appear to be, well, they got a little bit, so I'm gonna have to push them in. But uh, I'm also replace these right here. You know, put the new ones in, put the new brakes. Everything be straight on that end. But the brake pads, they don't really look the best. Yeah, they, they had got down pretty thin. I know every time, I, every now and then when I drive, I hear it strubbing, squeaking or whatever. But all oh, that's gonna be over with. Got some new brake pads. Oh yeah. So I'm gonna finish showing you everything. Also, also that know that this part of the brakes go down. They go down and uh, yeah, they, they, so the ones like that you can pull out or whatever, 
like you want to do it from the outside with that still on, it'll go down in there. Yeah, it go down in there. So when you put the new ones in, I make sure they 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 facing this way, facing each other. Both of the pads are like facing each other, and the back plates are to the back of the the pistons. And like I said, just make sure you put them down, put them down in there. Like you see them parts right there. Put them down in there. It should be good. So that just fit on into that slot. Yeah, just put it down in there like that. But uh, I'm about to quit playing around and going on and take these pads out and change these things out. I got to remove both of these pads in order to put the new things in there. And uh, we'd be good to go then. But we will show you how to do everything. You have any uh, comments, anything, just let me know. I'm also going to be showing you the radar uh, for this car. Like, a lot of times you get an error message. Well, you got bad weather. But we'll get to that, though. Show you that part, too. You want to take these out, just pull them out. They just insert in there and hold those brakes lock in them brakes help lock in them brakes so uh you want to take it out just pull it up pull it up in that just put it back the same way you, you put it in now just pay attention to how you take it out of there try to deal with the phone let me see okay here we go yeah put it out of there like that one as you see that one rusty looking in the way, so I'm going to definitely want to put it in the way. That's what it should look like. That rod right there. Just put it in that way. Yeah, just put it in that way. I'm going I'm to put the, put the first one in for everything. I take the other one out. Just in case I forget how it goes, I got something to show me how, how that one supposed to go. That's the new one. Like I said, just slide in the same way you got the other one. It should be identical. As you see right now, they are identical. So just slide in the same way. Okay, I got both of those in here. As you see, it look new. Doesn't look new, of course. Yeah, I got a flush at the bottom of it. So that the brake can slide in easy. And like I said, once you put the, all this back in, put the brakes in, and uh, of course I got to push the pistons in for the new brake pad gonna be larger. Put them in, and once you put everything back on top and put the bolts in and tighten them up, don't forget your pins, your clips, and your pins. Yeah, can I put these pistons over? I bought a tool to do it with, so it should push all of them over at the, at the same time. Yeah, these are gonna be the new brake pads. Of course, I got these from 1A Auto. You know what I'm saying? So, hey, be sure to check check out their stuff and, and order for them. They sell some good quality parts. That's the box for the brakes. I mostly deal with one A auto. All right, just put in my first brake. Brake pad. See how they look good. Sides below this. Mm -hmm. About to insert the other one out. If, if it ain't going in right, just make an adjustment to this the little silver pole. It got to be up so in order enough for this to fit in between it. And I ain't need no, and, and I ain't need to push the uh, push the piston back. So I, obviously I bought that tool for nothing, but I may need it in the future. I have also have a G80, so you have to have those for them kind if you don't use a flathead screwdriver with the old brake pad in there to push it back. I'm about to insert the new one. All right. Got everything in now. Got my brakes in now. Like I said, I end up not 
need it. I didn't need it to pull the push the piston back. Not on this particular car. Like I said, I'm working on a 2019 Genesis G90. This the big dog. But I also have a Genesis G80. Which is the little brother or sister. You know, with that one you prefer. Got them in there, everything looking good. I'm going to do the other side as well. So I'm finna go on and uh, put it back up and put my two bolts in. And um, then I put this back up and, and put the pins and stuff on the outside and the clips. And uh, that'll be it for this side. Then I'll just put the tire brake on. Yeah, well, I was thinking I didn't have to use it to push the piston in, but I ain't I had to use it when I got ready to put it back up. I ain't have enough, they want to open up wide enough. But now I got it. And of course I use this. This type of tool. Come in handy. Cause it pushed over all four pistons at the same time. Okay, so now all you gotta do now is with it still off the car, you only insert your pin and line them up. Insert your pin so you can able to line them up. And make sure they're able to stick through, the, through that part of it. And you, and you see the hole that you got to put your uh, little clip in. And that's also, you got to go through the brake pads and, and insert into a hole that's uh, over here. That's a little hole that's, that's for that, that pin. You can see once you... Kind of make it focus good once you push it in good. You should be able to see that hole right there on the side of that brake pad. Like they hear of it. And then all you do is put your pin in. Put your little clip in, I meant. And uh, I do the same thing for this one right here. Then we'll get ready to bolt everything back up and we'll be good. Yeah, before you push that, uh, pin in all the way make sure that you're able to move this brake pad clip over some ear over some that way you can then you'll be able to insert it into that little hole that it's supposed to go in that pin go in yeah make sure you can move this over some this part if it's too close you ain't gonna be able to see where where, where the pin need to go to so then you're able to just push it in and it go in that hole Try going in that hole right there. And once it go in that hole, it ain't all the way yet. But uh, once it go in the hole all the way, then you can line it up and put your clip in. Then once you're able to get it lined up, uh, go on and push it into the hole, and you can push that pad back over. See, now it's inserted in that hole so it'll stay in there like it's supposed to. So all you gotta do now is put that little clip in it. And just put the clip in uh where you see that little hole at. I'm trying to make it focus on. There's a little hole right there. Let me see, suppose I come back, I think. Let's see. Yeah. See that hole right there? That way it go at. And see then how they got it made. This little clip, I have a, a spot to lay at once you put it in there. It'll lay back in that little, that little hole they got right there. So I'm gonna put this one in. And it'll, it'll probably lay back in the little, in the little gap that it got right there for it. Put it in that hole and let it lay back. Then you'll be, it'll be good. Then I just bolt it back up. And once I bought it back up, I'm good to go in on this side. Just got to tie down the other side. Do the same thing. Yeah. See how I got both of them in now? Got that one in now. Pin in now. And make sure you hold the showing so you're able to put it, put that clip in. Same thing with this. Make sure you hold the showing so you're able to put the clip in. You know, that's the start of the pin. Right there. Started, but I pushed it in at. But I made sure I lined it up 
push it all the way to the other side and put shit in that hole. Then you'll be good. Like I said, like, subscribe, have any comments, y'all let me. As you see now, I started just tightening the e bolts up. Um, let me see. That bolt right there. Gotta finish tightening that up. And then uh in one at the top. I gotta finish uh that right there. That's how I'm gonna do. And uh, then I put the 10 millimeter bolt right there. You know, and then that'll be it. Everything else look good. I probably save myself a thousand dollars because I'm gonna do uh, both front and both back. So uh, that's it. Just put it back on with my iron wrench. Like I say, all the break. Need to invest in these. Real good. Got my bolts tight. One down now. And I got the one up here tight. I can see them. I don't think do nothing. You put that right where it need to be at. This 10 millimeter bolt. Let me zoom back out, so. Put it back in that little hole. So I got that little clip on it. It go in that little hole. That way it'll end up bolting up right. And that's it. Once I put that 10 millimeter bolt bite right there, only thing left to do is to put the tire back on. Like I said, I'm D. Jordan. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, comment. And like I said, I'm working on the 2019 Genesis G90. That's the first video that I've seen that I've seen on this type of car. Thank you. Have a blessed day.